Once there lived a princely prince whose powers came from heaven, and all the tribes had wanted him as chief for a shaman. Many dreams and mystic scenes painted in rust and gold were carried underneath his arm. His story now unfolds. I catch the planets in my nets like tiny little fish. I paddle in my boat, the moon. I go where I wish. I hold my lantern high for the sun. I have diamonds, pearls, and gold. I'm richer than any man alive, and I never will grow old. Well, I'm very tired right now. I think I'll lie down by the river and have a rest. While the prince was sleeping, a princess by the name of Many Minds came by the river to get it. She's a princess. Oh, wait a minute, we forgot about the spirits. The spirits of the river appear. Come on, spirits. Give me your water sounds. And the head spirit said, Spirits, let's teach this prince a lesson. This is pretty special, doesn't he? Let's change him into something. I know a feathered creature with big eyes who's wise. An owl. On the count of three, say, Ruby Red Roll with me. Get ready, spirits. Let's do it again. One, two, three. Ruby red road. Come on, spirits. Let's make like a river. Wave goodbye. The spell worked all night long on the bridge, so when the bridge woke, he wasn't a prince anymore, but at... You could see him high up on the tree, overlooking the river. And you could hear his lonely call. One day a princess by the name of Many Minds came by the river to collect water. I'll stop here and get what? No, I'll stop there. Here, there, here, there. Ah! All right, I'll stop here. Ah! Look at the reflection of the little owl. Oh, there it is. You little owl. It's not an owl, it's a man. Owl, man, owl, man. All right, it's a man, and boy, is he cute. Hi there, my name is Many Minds. What's your name? But the owl answered with his lonely call. Ooh, ooh. Many Minds fell madly in love with the reflection of the prince in the water, and she came back to see him again and again. But, as tradition would have it, Back in the village, Many Minds was to marry the chief. She wanted to marry the chief. She wanted to marry the prince. So that day by the river, she said, Oh, prince, whatever shall I do? I don't want to marry the chief. I want to marry... And then she thought, why is it every time I see the reflection of the owl, I also see the reflection of the... Maybe they're connected. So she said to the owl, Owl, could you come here please? I would very much like to speak with you. But the owl answered with his lonely call. Ooh, ooh. Very well then, I'll wait right here until you do. No, I'll wait there. 
Blanket of darkness lay over the forest. Back in the village, who was getting worried about many minds? The So he took his bow and his arrow and he went to find many minds. He went to find many. He didn't know why. But when he saw many minds talking with the owl by the river, he felt really jealous. So he did something silly. Well, because the owl is really the bridge. So he took his bow and arrow, and he aimed his arrow straight to the heart of the feathered creature. Ping! The arrow pierced the owl in the heart. The owl fell into the river, and when it did, sparks the color of blood. Make the sparks with me. Form scales so that the owl was no longer an owl but was transformed into a salmon, the wisest of fish. Many mice jumped in after him, and she was transformed into a salmon, the wisest of fish. Now that was a long time ago, many generations ago. As many as there are stars up in the sky. But we know, every spring or fall, when it's time for the salmon to spawn, the he salmon, make a he salmon with your hand, and the she salmon, make a salmon, they swim upstream against the current. You have to swim really hard, swim hard. Ha <laughs> jumping over rocks. Bubbling creeks, even out into the ocean, and then back again through the creeks, the rivers, and the streams, back to the very place they first met and fell in love. That's a story based on the first nation legend, The Birth of the Salmon, the end.